Okay, so Poly UGC just released, and I'm going to show you how to make a free UGC game where you need a certain amount of leader stats to be able to claim a free UGC. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need, you're going to need to make a UGC. So I'm hoping that you already have a UGC published, but I can show you the process on how to upload stuff like this. So I'm going to be using my sword that I made for this one. So I'm going to first start off by saying limited fixed quantity. I'm going to make 10 available just for the tutorial. And I'm going to do a limit of one per user. And it is going to be a free item. It is going to be resellable to others. And that's the first start. Then you want to go to sale location. Uh, I'm going to go to experiences and dev A API only. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get your game ID. So I'm going to go to my profile real quick. I'm going to go to my profile. I'm going to go to creations. And now I'm going to click this the game that I have it in right now. Now I'm going to get the profile ID. Copy and paste that then hit exit and then you're gonna wanna paste the place ID okay and then you're going to want to hit publish item now I'm not sure if you can if this is if this works but what if what if I said what if I said 20 okay then that would be that would be 2,000 robots so I'm just gonna do I'm just gonna do 10, which is a 1,001 Robux fee. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit publish item. So item type limited quantity 10, one uh, per user free item yes resellable yes play pay and publish. So once you have that published, you should be able to have your robux and then I believe it is 100 robux per thing so that's something so I'm gonna go to accessories back accessories right here and then I'm going to go to what are we gonna go to okay first I'm going to First, I'm gonna make this say 250 kills. Now I'm gonna hit save changes. And then I'm also going to go ahead and copy this ID. I'm gonna have to like uh, copy asset ID right there. So you wanna go three dots, copy asset ID. Then you wanna go back into your Roblox game and I made this free model so everybody can go ahead and grab this and probably link in the description or the pinned comment and go ahead and grab this and you are gonna see a whole bunch of stuff right here this free UGC sign so you're gonna see this you can change the text here so you can change the text to say whatever you want really if you go down here to the text label and then see right here the text change that text to whatever your game is and then right here you're gonna want to go to your free UGC little thingy right there and then you're going to want to go to the UGC giver script that's under this sorry for the parrot sounds so you're gonna double click that and then you're gonna see all this stuff all this stuff but right here it says replace your ID of the U of your UGC limited item. So right here, you're on line 11, I believe. You're gonna want to copy and paste the thing you just you just copied from your from your UGC limited, and that should be good. You want to hit play. There you go. And if you have if you have 
Here, let me just activate this. So right here. Oh, and also, here's here's another thing you gotta do. Here's another thing you gotta do. So if whatever your leader stats says, you, I'm assuming you have a leader stats by now. If you say if kills dot kills, just replace kills over here and over here and over here. Or yeah, just you just replace kills uh, and place kills with whatever your leader stats is. If it's bubbles, if it's coins or whatever, then just replace that with coins instead of kills. And then you can also replace this number, which is whatever number you want to be. Replace this number with what, however much leader stats you need. So I'm just going to say 250 for now. But that is all you really need to know. So now you can hit play. I'm going to drop a bomb on myself really quick so my leader stats shows up because I have a glitchy script. Oh my. Wow, I did not expect for that to happen. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I have 269 kills, so that means I can go ahead and hit claim. But there's also one more thing you need to do before you do this. So you want to go to file, and then game settings, and then you want to go to you want to go to security, and you want to enable allow third-party sales. So if you don't have that enabled, just click enabled. That way you can do that and as long as as long as you're able to hit play then you should hit and then you should be able to claim it if you have 250 kills it says I have zero kills but it's really 250 kills so that's how that should work but I'm just gonna go ahead I'm gonna go here I'm gonna hit Publish to Roblox. So then you can exit out of here. And then you want to go to your game. So you want to go to your game. Go Wooden Battlegrounds or whatever your game is. I actually forgot to, um. I forgot to save the game actually. So you want to go to Publish to Roblox as. And then. You're gonna wanna try to find. You wanna, you wanna try f find your thing. Overwrite. That way you can update the game. Should be published. So then you can go here. Refresh. If the game was updated today, then it should be all good. Any second now. Okay. So I shut down all servers. So it should be back up, and now it has the the free UGC claim thing. So as long as you have 250 plus things, you should be able to do it. And now I'm getting a whole bunch of players. 